Welcome to the second episode in our styling series. We're going to explore decorating with rattan. Of all of the product ranges I've stocked throughout my 20 years in retail, rattan is the one constant. Whether it's for storage, entertaining, or as a furniture choice, I love the way rattan adds textures, layers, and how easily it can be incorporated into almost every interior style. The history of rattan is rich and varied, with the use of decorative and practical woven natural materials dating back to early Egyptian and Roman times. An often asked question is, what is the difference between wicker and rattan? Wicker is an ancient technique of manufacturing natural materials such as rush, willow and rattan into furniture, baskets and decorative items, as it refers to the weaving of fibres rather than to the type of fibre used. You can use various fibres to create wicker. Rattan, on the other hand, is a type of vine which grows prolifically in Southeast Asia. It grows in the shape of a pole which, unlike bamboo, has a strong core which adds to its durability and at the same time is flexible which allows it to be steamed and shaped into a range of furniture and homewares and decorative items. Regularly used within coastal interiors and resorts as it allows airflow and light and has a relaxed appearance. However, added to formal rooms, it can avoid an interior space becoming too stuffy or unapproachable. Let's look at our favourite ways to decorate by room. In the living room, I use rattan trays to group and focus accessories and also as a firm platform on top of upholstered ottomans. I use it to protect glass surfaces and use coasters or rattan placemats to do so. Pretty rattan trays create an attractive platform for hand towels, candles and accessories. Use rattan storage boxes to contain cotton wool balls, toilet rolls and brushes. Rattan laundry baskets, tissue boxes and littered waste bins are also really useful decorative items for the bathroom. In the bedroom, Bedside trays are an attractive yet functional item that can group accessories while protecting furniture. Rattan bedheads, side tables and lamp lights can also be incorporated to work as a fabulous backdrop to soft furnishings and accessories. Dining tableware. Use rattan baskets to contain vases of cut flowers as a centerpiece. Interplay your formal dining table and ceramics with a casual base of rattan placemats and coasters. I like to mix rattan and ceramics with glass, linen and foliage to avoid the overall look becoming too heavy. My preference is to keep rattan to one colour in one area rather than mixing different shades but it really comes down to personal taste. I love whitewash rattan with bleach faded timbers. Grey wash rattan when creating Belgian style interiors as it works so well with natural materials of stone, concrete and rustic linen. Antique rich rattan pairs beautifully with leather, plaid upholstery and darker timbers. Entertaining. When entertaining it's great to create a zone where you can collate your glassware, spirits and bar accessories. Rattan bars, bar carts, Butler's trays, drinks trays, ice buckets and accessories create the perfect starting point. The fact that rattan is light and easy to manoeuvre, you can easily move it to our fresco areas or to a different area of your home. Furniture and decor. Rattan's ability to be shaped and bent results in a wider range of furniture options. From tables, buffets, desks, bedheads, chairs and chaises. The choice of complementary upholstery, cushions and throws can take rattan furniture from being the perfect choice for your summer conservatory through to a rich library or cosy living space. Rattan is lighter than traditional timber furniture which makes it easier to manoeuvre and it has the ability to lighten even the grandest of architecture. It's perfect for all seasons as it allows airflow and light depending upon the weave. Use rattan as vessels for your indoor and veranda plants, 
entranceway storage trunks and coat racks. Natural rattan can fade over time when exposed to sunlight, so it's really best indoor use. We'll cover how to carry this look outdoors in our Alfresco Styling Series, so be sure to subscribe and like this video to stay connected. I hope you've enjoyed this spotlight on rattan and has highlighted how it's a classic decorating choice and one that will be on trend for years to come. Thanks for watching and remember when creating a home you love, the beauty is in the details.